Welcome to another episode of Rip Fishing. Today I am wading down a river. I'm throwing nothing but a mouse pattern. I'm gonna see what hits. See how much fun it is. I'm not gonna switch. I'm gonna force myself to stick with it. I hope it turns out great. I'm expecting to get a few takes. I think there's gonna be a few smallmouth interested in it. I also think some larger chub will be interested in it as well. The weather is absolutely beautiful. Yesterday was a fun day out on the golf course, but to be perfectly honest, I'd rather be fishing. Looking forward to seeing the outcome, and I'll see you on the water. I put on this, uh, a Moorish mouse. Trimmed it nice and tight. Makes for a sleeker profile. Let's see what happens. And I have a take on a mouse pattern. First cast. Look at this fella. This is the mouse. It's killing it. Now this is just ton of fun. Most people, they'll never leave their home and say they're going to go chub fishing. But look at this. This is a tiny six inch chub and it just hit this Moorish Mouse pattern. And I am having just a ton of fun here. Another chub. They're a lot of fun. They're a lot of fun on a mouse pattern. He took it. Pretty good pull. Hasn't jumped. I think it's just a really good sized chub. Yeah, it is a big, good looking chub. So there you go. There's a decent sized chub that I've just caught on a Moorish mouse. Let him go. And that's just a lot of fun. These fellas just love mice.
tiny chub. The size of this fella. Getting a mouse pattern. What are you doing, buddy? Nice looking chub. If you guys ever believe that there is such a thing, got on this mouse pattern. Another chop. Another one. Right there, on the mouse pattern. Another one, back to back casts, and I am telling you, this is just an absolute blast. I know Chubb have a bad reputation, and I know why, but I also know some people are probably out there chasing trout and not catching fish this size and with this exciting of a method. Alright folks, that concludes another episode of Rip Fishing. The sun's just on the horizon now, which means i got to get back and get some food. It's an absolute blast. Just throwing a mouse pattern, seeing what happens. I think it speaks volumes to the impact that Chub can have on an ecosystem when they're not only going after every single fish they can see, but also terrestrials and mice and bugs. Regardless, that was a lot of fun. So until the next time, I'll see you on the water.